Hey guys, Cheesy Poof here, and we're here for the next edition of the Marvel Collector's Corpse opening, and this time it is X-Men. So, December 2016, that's who we get this time. So, hey bub, what are we going to see on the inside here? Opening it up, we have all these awesome X-Men comics there that you can see. So you got the Sentinels, you got Wolverine, Logan running around, looks like he's on his motorcycle. You got Cyclops on top, Magneto up there, Colossus throwing him. Oh, that's pretty sweet. Well, looks like the uh, the patch already came off, but we have Storm. It's also the Queen of Takala. Pretty awesome little patch there for the Collector's Corpse. And it looks like the pin is going to be Magneto's helmet there. So Collector's Corpse, pretty fun. Opening it up, what do we get? Looks like we definitely have basically superhero showdown for the next time. So Red Skull and Captain America. Ooh, are we going to get something fun like that maybe? We have Collector's Corpse Champions book, so you can see the Pop Cyclops, which is sweet. Oh, is this going to be Xavier's School for Gifted? For gifted youngsters, nice. Winchester, New York. Oh, look what we got, guys. So, Pops Ride with Wolverine and his motorcycle. So we got Logan driving this crazy beast of a motorcycle. So we'll definitely have to show that off in a second. And we have a... Mystique Rock Candy. Sweet. So some of these ones are pretty cool, actually. Uh, I enjoy that, like, Enchantress one that came with the uh, little Black Friday boxes at GameStop, even though they were in every single box. So we will have to show off one of those pretty soon here. But I'm going to bring out these figures in just a second if there's nothing else inside there. Just all the fun little art. Yeah. Looks pretty cool. All right, so let's see what these figures look like up close. So they do look pretty badass. Here's that Mystique. So even though it's a rock candy, I think this is the first one opened. It is a bobblehead as well. So I think that's just the way the X-Men license has to be. Um, but I could be wrong as well. Like any of the Marvel ones. You can see the little skull at her top. Her awesome red hair. The cute little <laughs> lips and cheeks and eyes that they put put on her. She's wearing her classic white with all the skulls dressed around her. She's got the blaster in her hand. The half-legging skirt, whatnot. And the little boots that were made for walking. You got underneath one of the little bases and that kind of stuff. So just the way that she can stand because it does look like she's a little top-heavy as well. And then you got Logan. Hey, bub. It's a Wolverine. Looks like they're trying to... Place this one with the movie. He's actually got a little bit of that old hair. The little gray hair is popping up. But you can see on side there. He's got his giant little chops. His crazy eyes. He's holding on to the bike. He does have his little claws popping out. Which is pretty sweet. And there's the rest of his bike. So this looks like something pretty sweet. Something that uh, Daryl from Walking Dead would love to. He's got a sleeping bag in the back. It says X-Men on the license plate. Little flames on there. Bike is pretty awesome. You can see like the dirt that they've put on there too. Which is pretty cool. It's all on the tires as well. Everything else that is on that bike there which is awesome. And although you can see he does have like the X on his figure. His little pants. The boots. He is able to come off of there. So you just gotta slightly unlock him. And then he pops right off. So we'll do that just so you can see him up close. So some people might be like, oh, why is Wolverine's crotch weird? Is so that, you know, you can actually take him off of the bike and lock him down to it in other places. So he's got that crazy little fur S jacket. Otherwise his hand's just floating because you know it's supposed to be on the bike. There's the, the Funko and the Marvel logo and all that stuff. His crazy bobblehead. And he does stand up pretty nicely, though, too. So you can see our fun little X-Men 
group together there. That's so cool. In the back over in Sarah's just having the little dots and stuff, but pretty sweet addition. I think uh, they did. a lot of people might not actually get to enjoy this little logo that's on the side of Logan's bike too because his legs are blocking the way, but you can see that skull and crossbones in with the dirt of the motorcycle. Pretty sweet, and it is actually on both sides. Did a pretty good job there, so you just got the Xavier's t-shirt, the comic book, Storm and Magneto, and then showing off everything that came in the box the other way around. You got the t-shirt, the comic, Rock Candy, Wolverine. Pretty fun. So, let me know what you guys think of this box. What's been your favorite one this year? Since we'll be on to the uh, <laughs> the next. And we got Superhero Showdown coming, I guess, January, February. <laughs> be pretty cool. And that being it for this time. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you later.